Hello, I'm Peter Schreier, and as Creolde School of Arts CEO and Executive Director, I'd like to one more time wish you a Happy New Year and lots and lots of good things ahead of you in 2022. There are certainly a lot of great things happening at Creolde School of Art, and I want to share a couple of them with you. In the middle of January, we are getting ready for two exciting new exhibitions that are opening up on our main campus here at 600 St. Andrews Boulevard in Winter Park. This Friday, January 21st, we are opening the Las Vegas Project, which is a photography documentary project where for the very first time, eight Creolde students under the leadership of their instructor ventured out 2,000 miles to the old Santa Fe Trail in New Mexico and created beautiful photographs and oral history that depict the story that is not so much known in contemporary American history recording. So I'd encourage you to come out this Friday for that very special event and meet those photographic artists from Creolde. One week from this Friday on January the 28th, our next exhibition will open curated by Barbara Tiffany and it is the three generations of Hurt Family Painter. Many of you are probably familiar with Maury Hurt, the legendary painter that uh, made Central Florida home for many decades. And, but probably very few of you are aware there are three other very talented artist painters that use the same name. So come out for that exhibition on the 28th. And next week is the beginning of our winter session. As of this afternoon, 724 students of all ages from a seven county region have signed up for a total of 83 courses taught by over 40 talented artists from Creolde's faculty that are all starting on this campus next week at Hannibal Square Heritage Center and also at the Jesse Brock Community Center in Winter Garden, where Creolde has been teaching classes for the last 12 years. At the same time, the very exciting news that I want to share with you is about the progress with our studio expansions. As you have probably read in our newsletter and in letters coming from our development team, Creolde has done incredibly well with enrolling new and repeating students over the last year as we have been slowly, slowly coming out of the crisis with the corona pandemic. There has been an unprecedented need for people to express themselves, to come out and work with their hands, to paint, to photograph, and also to work with clay in our studios that teach sculpture and ceramics programs. And the areas that have experienced the biggest growth pre-pandemic, during the pandemic, and now post-pandemic are our sculpture classes and our ceramics classes. So as you probably are aware of, we've been raising money to build two new studios. And I'm happy to announce you that 62 generous donors have donated over $106,000 to this project in the last two months only. Our goal is to raise $150,000, so there is still room and there is still time for any of you who still are maybe in a position where they would like to support this very, very worthwhile project. It's going to enable us to build two new studios in 2023 and to offer additional classes so we don't have to have the massive numbers on waiting lists that Creole has occurred uh, in 2000. And 21, which seems to be continuing in the same trend in 2022. I want to personally thank on behalf of the staff and our volunteer board of directors for all the support that we have already received from this project for the community. And just keep watching of all the good things that are happening at Creolde. And uh, I personally look forward to see each and every one of you on one of our campuses, in one of our classes, or one of our exhibitions in the months to come. Thank you so much and all the best for the new year.